for the term in genetics, see base, in chemistry, a base is a substance that, in aqueous solution, is slippery to the touch, tastes bitter, changes the color of indicators, reacts with acids to form salts, and promotes certain chemical reactions. Examples of bases are the hydroxides of the alkali and alkaline earth metals too, etc. Such substances produce hydroxide ions in aqueous solutions, and are thus classified as anias bases. For a substance to be classified as an anias base, it must produce hydroxide ions in solution a euro in order to do so, anias believed the base must contain hydroxide in the formula. This makes the anias model limited, as it cannot explain the basic properties of aqueous solutions of ammonia or its organic derivatives. In the more general Brian Stedea Euro Larry Acid a Euro base theory, a base is a substance that can accept hydrogen ions a Euro otherwise known as protons. In the Lewis model, a base is an electron pair donor. In water, by altering the autoionization equilibrium, bases give solutions with a hydrogen ion activity lower than that of pure water, that is, a pH higher than 7.0 at standard conditions. A soluble base is called an alkali if it contains and releases OH ions quantitatively. However, it is important to realize that basicity is not the same as alkalinity. Metal oxides, hydroxides, and especially orc oxides are basic, and counteranions of weak acids are weak bases. Bases can be thought of as the chemical opposite of acids. Bases and acids are seen as opposites because the effect of an acid is to increase the hydronium concentration in water, whereas bases reduce this concentration. A reaction between an acid and base is called neutralization. In a neutralization reaction, an aqueous solution of a base reacts with an aqueous solution of an acid to produce a solution of water and salt in which the salt separates into its component ions. If the aqueous solution is saturated with a given salt solute, any additional such salt precipitates out of the solution. The notion of a base as a concept in chemistry was first introduced by the French chemist Guillaume Frenet section Noir Raoul in 1754. He noted that acids, which at that time were mostly volatile liquids, turned into solid salts only when combined with specific substances. Raoul considered that such a substance serves as a base for the salt giving the salt a concrete or solid form. Properties Some general properties of bases include, slimy or soapy feel on fingers, due to saponification of the lipids in human skin. Concentrated or strong bases are caustic on organic matter and react violently with acidic substances. Aqueous solutions or molten bases dissociate in ions and conduct electricity. Reactions with indicators Bases turn red litmus paper blue, phenylphthalein pink, keep bromothymol blue in its natural color of blue, and turn methyl orange yellow. The pH of a basic solution at standard conditions is greater than 7. Bases are bitter in taste. Neutralization of acids, when dissolved in water, the strong base sodium hydroxide ionizes into hydroxide and sodium ions, NaONR plus plus OA, and similarly, in water the acid hydrogen chloride forms hydronium and chloride ions, HCl plus H, 2OH, 3O plus plus clap, when the two solutions are mixed, the H, 3O plus and OA ions combine to form water molecules, H, 3O plus plus OA 2 hours, 2O, if equal quantities of NaO and HCl are dissolved, the base and the acid neutralize exactly, leaving only NaCl, effectively table. Salt, in solution. Weak bases, such as baking soda or egg white, should be used to neutralize any acid spills. Neutralizing acid spills with strong bases, such as sodium hydroxide or potassium hydroxide can cause a violent exothermic reaction, and the base itself can cause just as much damage as the original acid spill. Alkalinity of non-hydroxides, bases are generally compounds that can neutralize an amount of acids. Both sodium carbonate and ammonia are bases, although neither of these substances contains O groups. Both compounds accept H plus when dissolved in protic solvents such as water, Na2CO3 plus H2OA2 Na plus plus HCO3 plus OH, NH3 plus H2O NH4 plus plus OH. From this, a pH, 
or acidity, can be calculated for aqueous solutions of bases. Bases also directly act as electron pair donors themselves, CO32 plus H plus HCO3, NH3 plus H plus NH4 plus, carbon can act as a base as well as nitrogen and oxygen. This occurs typically in compounds such as butyl lithium, orcoxides, and metal amides such as sodium amide. Bases of carbon, nitrogen and oxygen without resonance stabilization are usually very strong, or superbases, which cannot exist in a water solution due to the acidity of water. Resonance stabilization, however, enables weaker bases such as carboxylates. For example, sodium acetate is a weak base. Strong bases, a strong base is a basic chemical compound that can remove a proton from a molecule of a very weak acid in an acid-base reaction. Common examples of strong bases include hydroxides of alkali metals and alkaline earth metals like NaO and Ka, OH, 2. Very strong bases can even deprotonate very weakly acidic Ka UROH groups in the absence of water. Here is a list of several strong bases, potassium hydroxide, barium hydroxide, 2, cesium hydroxide, sodium hydroxide, strontium hydroxide, 2, calcium hydroxide 2, lithium hydroxide, rubidium hydroxide, the cations of these strong bases appear in the first and second groups of the periodic table. Acids with a pKa of more than about 13 are considered very weak, and their conjugate bases are strong bases. Superbases. Group 1 salts of carbonions, amides, and hydrides tend to be even stronger bases due to the extreme weakness of their conjugate acids, which are stable hydrocarbons, amines, and dihydrogen. Usually these bases are created by adding pure alkali metals such as sodium into the conjugate acid. They are called superbases, and it is impossible to keep them in water solution because they are stronger bases than the hydroxide ion. As such, they deprotonate the conjugate acid water. For example, the ethoxide ion in the presence of water undergoes this reaction. CH 3CH, 2O plus H, 2O CH, 3CH, 2OH plus OA, here are some superbases, butyl lithium, lithium disopropylamide, CH3, 2CH2 NLI, lithium diethylamide, C, 2 hours, 5, 2 NLI, sodium amide, sodium hydride, lithium bis, trimethylsilyl, amide, CH, 3, 3C, 2 NLI, Bases as catalysts, basic substances can be used as insoluble heterogeneous catalysts for chemical reactions. Some examples are metal oxides such as magnesium oxide, calcium oxide, and barium oxide as well as potassium fluoride on alumina and some zeolites. Many transition metals make good catalysts, many of which form basic substances. Basic catalysts have been used for hydrogenations, the migration of double bonds, in the mayer wayne pondorf early reduction, the Michael reaction, and many other reactions. Uses of bases, sodium hydroxide is used in manufacture of soap, paper and a synthetic fiber called rayon. Calcium hydroxide is used in the manufacture of bleaching powder. Magnesium hydroxide is used as an antacid to neutralize excess acid in the stomach and cure indigestion. Sodium carbonate is used as washing soda and for softening hard water. Sodium hydrogen carbonate is used as baking soda in cooking food, for making baking powders, as an antacid to cure indigestion and in soda acid fire extinguisher. Etymology of the term, the concept of base stems from an older alch Michael notion of the matrix. The term a euro o a euro appears to have been first used in 1717 by the French chemist, Louis la copyright Mary, as a synonym for the older Parisian term a euro o a a euro. In keeping with 16th century animism, Paracelsus had postulated that naturally occurring salts grew within the earth as a result of a universal acid or seminal principle having impregnated an earthy matrix or womb. Its modern meaning and general introduction into the chemical vocabulary, however, is usually attributed to the French chemist, Guillaume Frenet section wa Raoul. Raoul explicitly defined a neutral salt as the product formed by the union of an acid with any substance, be it a water-soluble alkali, 
a volatile alkali, an absorbent earth, a metal, or an oil, capable of serving as a euro or a basi a euro for the salt a euro or a b giving it a concrete or solid form a euro most acids known in the 18th century were volatile liquids or a euro or asperites a euro capable of distillation, whereas salts, by their very nature, were crystalline solids. Hence it was the substance that neutralized the acid which supposedly destroyed the volatility or spirit of the acid and which imparted the property of solidity to the resulting salt. See also, acids, acid-base reactions, base richness, conjugate base, titration, further reading, Jensen, William B. The origin of the term base. The Journal of Chemical Education 83, 1130. DOI. 10.1021 slash shadow 83p 1130 references